Приветствую вас, драгоценные партнеры. Знаете, сегодня прекрасный день. Greetings, в этот precious день я partners. Вас и you know, today вас, is a beautiful day on this day. I bless you and wish each of you that this uplift occurs in your life, so that the harvest has already come, and I know that it has already come. Many things have already happened. Believe me, it has happened that you are not even aware of. Where possible, the devil could kill someone from your loved ones, but God saved. Where, perhaps, something could happen to the Swami, but God saved. God gives you the strength to stand where others fall. But the most important harvest is yet to come. You know, I sometimes think about one thing about health because life is the most important thing. You know, it's health. Health is something without which a person practically cannot be happy. He cannot be filled with some joys of life. He does not need any things. He does not need anything at all because health deprives you of everything. When there is no health, there is no happiness. But you are a partner. You are the person who ministers exactly in this anointing and the anointing that brings health to people, that brings people healing from incurable diseases. Every time I look at the testimony, I know I just talk to people. People come up to me, shake hands, thank them, and I look at them. I think, you know, this man is amazing. He has already buried himself. Some already knew that they would die, and when they died, they were already told, but they are alive. I'm starting to think it's thanks to the partners that the Word of God has reached their home. You know, it's amazing. So most of the evidence is of healing from cancer, healing from the most, you know, severe, incurable diseases that we can, well, see. Yes, most of all they occur at home, because people are discharged from the hospital home without hope. And there are TV channel, is YouTube channel, satellite TV channel, our social networks reach people. People, as if by chance, you know, run into our prayers on our sermons and receive supernatural healing. Why by chance? You should know why. Because God does it all. A person dropped the remote control, our channel turned on. A person just clicked something and ran into our channel. Sometimes the TV itself turned on and our channel turned off. People say whatever they want, because in this way the God remains anonymous. You know what's interesting? These people, they get life and your precious partners, are the greatest blessing to the God who planned salvation for them. He didn't just plan on a piece of paper. He paid for this salvation on the cross. Jesus Christ shed blood, experienced shame, experienced a beating, torment, who bore all the sins of the world. He became sin himself. For them, so that only they can be healed. What do you mean to God? What do you mean to these people? Think not only for those who are healed, but for their loved ones. You know, I saw, I remember one couple. When my wife died, they were over 60 years old, both the wife and the woman. She died. The man was absolutely healthy. 
literally three months passed, up to four months, and he also died. Because they loved each other so much, he just couldn't bear it. Today I turn to you, I say, may God bless you, may God fill your life, may all the best things in life happen to you, because you are sowing all these seeds of life. You don't sow the seeds of death, you don't sow the seeds of pain, you don't sow the seeds of suffering, you sow the seeds of goodness, of love. The most important supernatural anointing of the Holy Spirit. It is as if you are opening the door for the Holy Spirit to enter someone's house. That's what you do with your finances. Stay true. Stay stable. Remain those who dream of opening. If he opens one door today, dreams of opening ten doors, Dreams of opening 10. Dream to open 100, open 1,000, and God will open opportunities for you. Thanks to all partners. Thank you to all businessmen, because you must know what you are doing. If you are aware, then through your awareness, blessings will begin to pour powerfully into your life. My realization began with the fact that God did not show what he is doing through my ministry and through Vitochki's service. I bless you to realize, what is he doing through you? May the peace of God come to you, bless you, amen.